السلام عليكم to everyone and Ramadan Mubarak. May Allah make this a blessing month for you, your family, your friends, and anyone that you love. May it be a blessed, blessed month for us all. Inshallah. If you've read the title of book, then you know what this video is going to be. We are going to be finally decorating for Ramadan for the first time on YouTube, TikTok. We're not really new at it. We've done it like two years in a row, but on YouTube, it's the first time. So you get your hot drink, you get your snack, you kick back because it's going to be a long video and we're going to be decorating obviously our living room and the kitchen Ooh. possibly our bedroom guys it's going to be exciting so kick back relax make sure you like subscribe and also comment and also share this video as Peace. well okay so firstly guys we've got my little ramadan tree that i made well it's not even a tree it's a bad veg on it like a bit angled like no this like way, that. yeah. Like that. We'll push it back a little bit. Back? Yeah. More? That's fine. Oh like that? So yeah guys this is the pampas tree that i made you probably would have seen it on tiktok i literally made this all from scratch out of a um hobbycraft box um and yeah like i absolutely love how it's turned out so it's done, eh? and you can like put the lights on and everything like that so we're gonna put this in the corner next to the gold mirror here also as well we're gonna put like some little things on the floor so i'll show you guys next Ooh. what we put there okay guys we decided to switch to voiceover just to give you guys something different here i'm just putting some arches along with my pampas moon and pampas floral set and mainly our main focus is just to keep to the color scheme which is beige gold and white here we've put some eve party sacks um next i'm gonna add a little bit of gold by using this footstool from amazon and also i'm gonna try to pair some more gold in with um using a book stand that i actually got from h&m it's absolutely perfect for styling and i'm gonna put a Quran on there instead of a fashion book or something just to give it more of like a family vibe and obviously Ramadan vibe in having the Quran out. Next hubby is putting out some canvases that I created. We're also putting out some Hessian um, other accents like these stars from Primark. Again if you've watched my video previously you will see a haul of all these stuff. Again we use an Eid party banner. Again in the same Hessian fabric in a geometric Moroccan print. Absolutely love this. It was easy to put up. I literally just attached it as you can see here to one of the handles and then I used some sellotape just to extend it further out because I could tell it wasn't going to manage staying up by itself if I didn't put some tape down. And then next I'm going to take out the candles which are from Primark along with these frames that i created just from printing them from google so i'm going to put those out and they look absolutely stunning on the mantelpiece along with the candles next to them which is just gonna be a great addition next i'm going to be putting out this garland that i had gotten from zara i actually got this last year in the christmas sale i actually just thought it'd be perfect for ramadan I absolutely like the foliage on it is dried flowers and i feel like it just goes amazing with the decor again with the soft browns i'm then going to be pairing it with these gift tags that i've gotten from the lutz and co i'm actually doing a collab with them currently so if you want the discount code that is attached below here hubby is helping me out with it and you'll see us in a minute do a little race because he was trying to beat me guys but obviously i ended up doing it a little bit quicker but at the same time i feel like we were neck and neck you decide in the comments so here I'm just pairing with the garland some candles that I actually picked up from Amazon. Again, that will be linked below. I'm also going to be pairing it with my Hobbycraft sign that I created on TikTok. So if you want to see that, you know where to go find it. And then also I'm going to be pairing it with some lanterns that I actually got from Ikea. These are absolutely stunning and a statement piece for any Ramadan decor. How stunning is this Ramadan Mubarak sign again from Eid Party in the Hessian fabric. Absolutely just had to place it here because I just feel like it tied in perfectly with the room. But the most exciting part is up next. So here I am doing the cushions along with Hubby. We got these from Ikea. Absolutely affordable. I think they were like £2 per case. And here's Hubby actually teaching me how to put them in correctly just because I was actually struggling at one part. Like the width of them was a bit off. 
But um, yeah, he taught me how to do it without crinkling the case too much because I spent too much time ironing them. Also, I've got these other pillowcases from H&M, which are absolutely nice. Again, they go with the fabric along with the Shein covers as well. Guys, all of the stuff will be linked below. You have to go watch our previous haul video. Okay, so here I have this nice little teapot that I'm just going to put in the corner just so it's perfect for when guests come around. I'm also going to put these Harrods cups with them. They weren't that expensive. Perfect little four cups just so it's more than enough for if any additional guests come around. Along with these star candles here, they're absolutely stunning from Primark. Got them in the Christmas sale. Next, I'm also going to be putting a wooden lantern that has Ramadan on it along with some battery operated lights at the bottom. I thought that just look how it turned out, all of the Nutritones all together. This is exactly how I love my living room to look. Okay, guys, now we're going to start to do the um, kitchen table. You've seen that I've done the living room. I've also done um, the fireplace and also um, a little counter within the kitchen. Now it's for the table. I'm super excited about this. I'm trying to really just go for a monochrome look. I know in the living room we've got like touches of brown, beiges and some whites. But in here I just want literally black and white because that's my kitchen. So yeah, let's get into it. So again, I wanted to keep it super simple when it came to decorating the table. Hence why H&M is a perfect place to always have the simple things. Some of the stuff that I did were DIY of my own. I always have to make sure I have a Jo Malone candle. So that had to be paired with it. I made sure that the colours, again, were monochrome touched. Um, I made sure I used glass because glass is always great when you want to do that monochrome finish. Candles are always my go-to. I also made sure I had a table runner. Table runners, again, just add to that classy feel and make it just great for dinner time. Next, I also made sure that I added silverware. Silverware is also perfect because, again, it just ties into the monochrome look. I also made sure that I did some tea towels as well to add to the cookout. Okay guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, I tried my best this Ramadan to decorate as much as I possibly could. And yeah, we've absolutely been so excited. Obviously, we started our Ramadan series early on. So if you guys just want to refresh and see what we um, bought in the Ramadan um, series, obviously I've decorated with them. But if you want to see where I got them from specifically and also any links, please go check those videos out and yeah guys make sure you like and subscribe please leave in the comment section any suggestions that you may have of what you want to see in the daily vlogs because we're going to be daily vlogging inshallah ramadan mubarak to you and yours and guys again make sure you are subscribed because we're going to be having three lucky subscribers win our giveaways we've got one giveaway for £150 worth of beauty products and another giveaway for two lucky winners to get their henna done by Yasmin's Artistry for Eid. So literally, we're trying to cover everyone. So you're getting a little bit of makeup, a few pamper items. And already, we did a Joe Malone giveaway, which a lucky subscriber already won. So 
yeah you're missing out if you're not entering and literally all of the steps on how to enter will obviously be linked below really and truly it's going to be through my instagram so if you're not following me on instagram as well link is below guys but yeah again ramadan mubarak inshallah you have a lovely lovely blessed month and inshallah you get all the benefits possible take care guys and i'll see you soon bye